welcome to another video i know i know i was supposed to put this out months ago but your girl has been living life okay it hasn't been living her wait never mind that didn't that didn't that didn't work out right in my head it anyway regardless <laughs> I am back with the update this has been long awaited and I know I've been getting all of your messages and your comments on my videos for um, almost two years ago I've had this treadmill for almost two years and would I still recommend it absolutely does it still work yeah it's <laughs> definitely it still works I'm gonna do a live demonstration or it's not gonna have no, uh, you're gonna hear how it sounds when I run on it and when I walk on it. And so you can gauge how loud it is. So stay to the end of the video if you wanna hear the treadmill. And let me just tell you, this treadmill, I probably put about, I know on my Nike app, y'all find me on there. Um, if y'all are interested, we can all, you know, be a team. Um, next time I have a challenge, I will announce it. So y'all follow me on Nike app as well. Nike Run Club. But okay, this treadmill has about, I would say at least 70 miles on it. So yeah, it has about 70 miles on it. And I tend to still do at least at minimum a two mile minimum every time i use it i only use it about twice a week i used to use it about five times a week so this has been well used and well managed so i'm gonna just tell you guys the only downfall to this pink treadmill and i hate to say it is the color um pink because i love pink that's that's my jam but the issue is if you have dirty ass kids or um, a dirty little doggy, they like to play on it and the pink turns, it, it, it's dirty, okay? And you can see it. So I gotta figure out a way to clean it. Have I had to apply the, the tread oil to the treadmill? I have not, I still have not done that. Um, it doesn't really squeak or anything. Um, even at a, a high speed of running, you know, again, this treadmill is not the same size as a traditional treadmill. So it is made for walking, a fast walk, a slight jog, a medium sized jog, or however you say medium sized, what in the hell? I just wanted to come on here and show you guys a live demonstration. Would I still recommend this treadmill? Absolutely. Have I had any issues with it? No, other than me breaking off a piece of it myself with my weight, um, I haven't had any issues. Um, it, it still works as perfect as I got it day one. I am not sponsored. You know, this was something I wanted to do for me in 2000 and the beginning of 2020. It's almost 2022 and this treadmill still works. I personally wanted to meet my fitness goals and I am still on the fitness journey. You know, this is a this is a journey. This is a lifestyle change. It's not just you working out. It's truly a lifestyle change. Um, but for the most part, I'm not wearing any type of waist trainer and I'm still, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm going in, you know what I'm saying? I'm slimming down. Can I say it started my weight loss journey? Absolutely. It truly kick-started my weight loss journey. Um, and y'all saw in the previous video, and that was over a couple of weeks span that my body kind of just, you know, started to, you know, curve off the, in the right way, you know? So, yeah, so let me go ahead, put my shoes on, get on the treadmill, do a live walk with no, you can't hear anything. And if you hear the clicking in the background, that is my oldest son playing his video game. So, um, I'll go ahead and do a live walk and a live run with no um, music over it or anything so y'all can hear it. Two years. It's almost 70 miles that I have run personally on this treadmill um, and it has been the best purchase. The only downfall again is the color. If you have little bad kids um, that jump on stuff and they want to use their shoes that they run outside with or you have a dog, my kids have put my dog on the treadmill. It's going to get dirty. So it really depends on your situation and your lifestyle. If you could deal with the little dirt, I have no choice because I have little, little monsters. 
but if you can deal with a little dirt here and there <laughs> um, and you can actually see it, feel free. But that's been the only downfall, honestly. Um, so I would say if you have a high traffic type of household with kids and dogs and stuff, get the black one. If you're a girly girl, you don't mind a little dirt here and there <laughs> with the kids or maybe you're single, you don't have no kids, girl, this is for you. This is for you. Apartment living, house living, you can live on the second, I believe you can live on um, like the second or third floor, fifth floor, whatever floor you live on and you're still not going to make a loud noise running and walking on this treadmill. I would say it is still a good purchase. I would go get it if they still have it. I'll link uh, some of the, what is still current. Um, again, I bought this two years ago with my own money. I did purchase the protection plan um, and I haven't had to use it at all. The protection plan was like $19. I think this is under $250 total, maybe less than that. And it may be even less now, two years later. But I still do highly recommend this pink treadmill. I love little old Pinky and I will definitely be keeping her. All of my equipment that I'm going to be getting. I'm going to be getting a Peloton soon guys. So stay tuned for that. If y'all are interested, this is going to be a real live uh, review. I always wanted a Peloton so your girl has worked herself up to saving enough to get her her bike. Okay, so talking to third person, my son always makes fun of me about that, but I'll stop chattering and get to doing a live demonstration. First is gonna be the normal pace that I run, about a 4.5 or five, and then, or really a four speed, and then I'll crank it up to seven speed um, so you can hear it. And I am not on the first floor in my house, so you'll, you'll hear everything. Okay, you guys, so that was the honest, true sound and review of the treadmill. As you can see um, right here, yeah, the track is dirty. It is dirty. And I got to clean it. When I figure out what I'm doing and how I'm going to clean it, I'll come back with an update video on the cleaning of the, the uh, track of the treadmill. But that's only, that's the only downfall for this entire 
purchase just the color like I said before as you can hear it's not very loud and I didn't choose the best shoes these are kind of clunky they're for like weightlifting and stuff like that they can be used for running but it's not like a running running super running shoe but it feels comfortable so um, I think that's the only reason why you heard some of the noise but if you have any further questions regarding this treadmill when I tell you pinky has done your girl right almost two years and counting um, she's still doing your girl right so if you have any further questions um, more detailed questions you have regarding this treadmill go ahead and leave them down below and I'll answer them when I see them bye and subscribe like subscribe comment and do all that good stuff be a part of the family if you love these types of videos I'll keep making more bye